Hi, welcome to today's burning question. What's the pros and cons of hindgut fermenter versus foregut fermenter? Come follow me. Here we have a horse. He's a hindgut fermenter. What really is a hindgut fermenter? Basically, a hindgut fermenter is an animal that has their fermentation chamber behind the stomach and the small intestine. These chambers are called the cecum and the large intestine. These chambers are located near the end of their gastrointestinal tract, hence the name hindgut fermenter. Now let's move on to our foregut fermenter. You have to use a bit of your imagination, but here we have a highland cow. And she's a foregut fermenter. <clears throat> As the name suggests, a foregut fermenter ferments their food before the small intestines in a, in a chamber called the rumen. The rumen actually occupies the whole left side of the abdomen. Yes, it's huge, but what's the difference between a foregut and a hindgut fermenter? Which one's better? In order for fermentation to happen, these chambers need to be filled with microbes that can break down plant fibers into energy cells. When these microbes die, they become important microbial protein, which can then be absorbed in the small intestines. Not if you remember, hindgut fermenters have their chambers after the small intestine. This means that any microbial protein will be lost in feces. Now, unless they eat their feces, hindgut fermenters can never get their hooves on this important microbial protein. In comparison, since foregut fermenters have their chambers before the small intestines, they have no problem absorbing these nice microbial proteins. However, being a foregut fermenter, also means that she has to let her little microbe body eat first before being able to use any leftovers for herself. So if she has any good quality feed while I her, too bad the microbes eat first. This put her at, at a bit disadvantage for any good quality feeds. Various hindgut fermenters eat first, leaving the less digestible bits to their microbes body. This puts them at, at an advantage for higher quality feeds. Huge rumen of foregut fermenters allow them to eat a lot and eat fast. They can also bring it up to chew later in a process called ruminations. Hindgut fermenters cannot do that. So in short, foregut fermenter gets to enjoy the quantity of food, while hindgut fermenter gets to enjoy the quality. To me, both are great.